The first stage of the US presidential election, the presidential primaries, kicks off this week as Republican voters in Iowa will choose who they want to be their candidate. Unlike primary contests, where voters cast secret ballots in elections run by local governments, a caucus is just a meeting run by the political party themselves. At the meetings, there will be around 1,700 caucuses in Iowa. Representatives make speeches on behalf of their candidate. At the end, voters indicate their preference for a nominee to represent the party. At Republican caucuses, it's just a secret ballot that party members in attendance will vote in, whereas at Democratic caucuses it's more complicated, with people having to physically gather with other supporters in the room. These votes translate into who the delegates to the National Party Convention will be, where the presidential candidate is actually confirmed. To become the presidential nominee, a candidate typically has to win a majority of the 2,429 delegates. The results of the vote by the Iowa Republicans will determine how many of the state's 40 convention delegates each candidate will receive. While the caucuses can provide a snapshot of voter opinion, none of the winners of the Iowa caucuses in 2016, 2012 and 2008 went on to capture the party's nomination. In 2020, Trump coasted to victory in the Iowa Republican caucuses, winning 97% of the vote and cinching 39 delegates. The New Hampshire presidential primary election for both the Democratic and Republican candidate is then held on Tuesday the 23rd of January. It's the first presidential primary election that will use the traditional secret ballot to decide the designated delegates. Trump is favourite to win in this primary for the Republicans. Next on the Republican presidential primary calendar are the caucuses in Nevada on the 8th of February and then the primary election in South Carolina on the 24th of February. The beginning of March will see a flurry of Republican primaries and caucuses before Super Tuesday on the 5th of March when more than a dozen states will award delegates to the party conventions.